Hi, it's Mark Owen from Move Smart PR, editor of Punchline Magazine. Welcome to Punchline Talks. Today I'm with David Oakhill, he's the uh, head of place at Gloucester City Council. We're in King Square at the moment, and over there is the old Debenhams building, which is going to be turned into the new university campus. We've got King's Walk over here, and we've spent around how much money on King's Square? Uh, it's part of the overall package for the whole site and the overall package is about 100 million. Wow, okay, and it's looking good, isn't it? It's very popular, and we, as we scoot around here, we've got the uh, the bus terminal over there, and this is what the forum is hopefully gonna look like. When it's all absolutely, adjusted. yeah, absolutely. You can see it coming out of the ground already. Yeah, and there it is. I mean, it's looking magnificent, isn't it? So, how, Kia are building it. They are. When are they due to finish? They're due to finish in the summer of 2024, so about right. 18 months away. Okay. <laughs> And the council must be pretty excited about it all now. Yeah, we're really excited. We're really excited about the whole area, really. You know, we've got the new university coming. Uh, we've got four and a half thousand new students. We've got a thousand new jobs coming in into here. Brand new four-star hotels for the city centre. So, yeah, really positive news for us. And Cart has been building this uh, this uh, bunch of flats that we're looking at now called White Fries. White Fries. That's right. It's really, you know, it's a good news story. A really good local contractor, uh, and, and they've done a really good job, and everyone's really happy with them. Yeah. And over there, obviously, this is Tesco Express that used to be around the corner by the bus station. They got a brand new store as well, which is looking looking very good. It looks a lot bigger as well than the other store. Yeah, it's a little bit bigger. It's probably it's, it's squarer, so it suits them. It certainly suits them well. Absolutely. Well, well, I'll make sure I get my bottle of Merlot on the way back out there. Then. Anyway, so let's have a look inside here, then, uh, David. Come on in. Thank you very much. Ooh, that's a lot better. It's a bit cold out there. Well, I love the smell of the fresh concrete, actually, it's really nice. Yeah, so we, uh, this is the first phase of a number of residential buildings that are going to happen in this area. Uh, this is the first block, this is 19 apartments, one, two and three bed. Uh, and I'm going to take you to show you the show flat. Okay. Well, straight away you can see the finish is very good. Yeah, the idea for us has been, you know, city centre home living, uh, but also Quality. We want this to be a quality place to live, so it's something we have to as well. So what are the flats price range from then, David, and how sort of big are we talking about? Are three, four bedroom, two bedrooms? So we've got, we've got a studio, one, two and three beds. Okay. And the prices range from sort of 200 up to the early 300s. Uh, went on the market uh, just before Christmas. We've got a really good level of activity so far, so uh, yeah. Good stuff. About it. Any of the deals closed? Uh, very close to being. Okay, that's what we really like to hear. Okay, so this is flat number, what's this? This is number four. Oh, wow. Wow, that's, that's really big, isn't it? A lot bigger than I imagined it was going to be. You've got the work around there as well. So obviously... That's the building works going on there. Nice, nice, uh, nice wood roofs. Wow. Oh, that's very nice. That again is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Really nice finish too. How big would you say that is? In feet, any idea, David? It's quite hard to tell really, isn't it? Eight by eight. Eight by eight. Yeah, so this is the master, the ensuite. Yeah, very nice. I'll tell you what, it's, 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 it's really big. You know, I've been to a lot of new builds, it's yeah, nothing like this. So the size is actually brilliant. Looking as we walk around the corner. Again, that's, that's really good size for a second. Is there room for a wardrobe here? No. That's a shame, isn't it? But it's still so big. And your storage area out, oh, right. out in the hallway. Okay, yep. And then you've got the main bed, uh, main bathroom. Oh, wow, that's nice as well. Hey, there's me! Anyway, Brian. And you've got your main living space. Wow, that's very nice too. Yeah, sort of nice little snug there, isn't it? Absolutely. And room for the dining table here. And a bit of, a uh, bit of private outdoor space. Oh, wow, there's the... Is it okay, Gavin? Absolutely. Very good, there's the, there's the guys from Kira all beavering away. Sort of same level as well. It's really killed on, isn't it? Absolutely, yeah. Really, really happy with progress. Absolutely. 
And you can imagine when this is finished, this will be you know, a top quality mixed use development uh, right in the heart of the city. Yeah, we're, we're really excited about it. Yeah, not surprised actually. It's pretty scoop back in. I'm sure it's the door because it is, it is cold out there. So you've got that, that private space and then upstairs you've got uh, a shared outdoor space as well for, for all the residents. That's really good, good, uh, good appliances. You've got Bosch there. Yeah. This is a dishwasher. Yeah. Neff dishwasher. Yeah. Fridge fr freezer. Fridge freezer. Oh, very nice, very nice. And again, it's a good fish. And of course, we've got the seagull ship <laughs> the window already. Hey. Very nice. I think you must be really chuffed. Absolutely, yeah. Really pleased with it. Thanks very much for showing me around. Thank you. you.